the COVID outbreak has um, affected a lot of people, including myself and obviously a lot of uh, the students and my friends, which has been really tough. Uh, the biggest thing that affected for me was not only did it stop my graduation, uh, cancel classes, or at least in-person classes, it stopped my baseball season. The toughest thing about being a senior athlete is usually the end of the season where it's your final time playing on a college field or on a field in general, at least in a competitive sense. So to have our season taken away after four games is um, was really painful. It was really painful for me, my teammates, and my family. Since the pandemic began and we all had to go home, the one positive thing I've taken away from this is that I've gotten to spend more time with my family. I've really just most importantly made sure that they're all right, I'm all right, and that, that's the most important thing right now. While it's tough for losing baseball, graduation, all those things for my last semester at New Paltz, I'm very thankful that I get to be with my family in this time and that we're all safe. I've been trying not to get too wrapped up in my own head about what's happened to my situation uh, during this pandemic. Like I've mentioned, losing baseball and losing the rest of my semester is tough, but I can't be selfish because there are a lot of family-owned restaurants near me that I've been going to for years, and they've shut their doors because of this pandemic, because they simply just can't afford to keep business running during this. And I'm uncertain they're ever going to open their doors again. The pandemic also changed my normal way of life. Right now, in a normal semester, I'd be going to class in person, I'd be going to baseball practice, and I'd be traveling a lot for baseball. Even with the gyms closing, um, the gym's a big part of my routine, but now I really have had to make my own sort of gym at home. Losing the baseball season wasn't only tough for me and the rest of my teammates. It's really tough on, you know, the parents. I'm the only child. My parents were looking forward to seeing my senior day and watch me walk for graduation. But now they're not going to have the opportunity to see that. And that's also a tough thing about it is because while I was really looking forward to playing a full season, I can't be selfish and only think about me. My parents wanted to get to witness those things along with me. So that's also a really tough situation that happened from the pandemic. It's something I've never thought I'd say, but I really do miss going to all my classes in person. It's something that you tell a student at any point that they don't have to go to class and we're all going to be happy. But now I do nothing more than to just show up to one of my classes and just sit in the classroom again. I, um, I'm in two capstone classes this, uh, this semester. And it's really supposed to shoot you into the professional world. And um, it's really exciting. And now that a lot of these classes have really been contained and we can't do 100% of the work that we originally were going to do in them, it's really something that I wish I never took for granted. Because even as uh, little as something as just showing up to a classroom for a normal lecture is something I'd really want to do right now. And I think that's something that in the future, it's it's going to show me that I shouldn't take the little things for granted, like getting to see my friends, going just to play baseball again with friends. Like All those moments can really be taken away from us at any moment. So if anything, a big positive outlook I have from this situation is just to really enjoy every little moment we get in life, don't take our health for granted, and really just enjoy every moment we have with our friends and family. I'm hopeful that once the pandemic blows over, and it will blow over, that us as a community, as a country, and as a human race will all embrace each other more and really come together. Because this pandemic has not only tested the United States, but it's tested the whole world. And for the first time in my life, and really anybody's life, this is something that's threaten their normal day livelihood. But I'm hopeful that in the future, everybody's gonna come together and be stronger from this. The sun will rise tomorrow. I'm sure that better days will follow. <laughs>